YTDC what's the deal. Now, we know the Summer Olympic Games are soon approaching. The super heavyweight division at the Olympics is something I'm going to be paying close attention to. I'm very excited from the field that um, has been formed already. My favorite, who I think when I just break down their skill level and just fights I've seen, um, Filip Herkovic from Croatia. He's the guy who I think might win the gold medal. Um, Ivan Daichko from Kazakhstan. You got, uh, shit, man, Tony Yoko, who I've done videos on from France. Linear Perot from Cuba. I mean, it's, it's, the field is building up pretty nice as it is, but this is the Olympics, and I'm going for my Americans. Now, who I want to win, I hope Marlo Moore can make it to the Olympics. He is still in the process of trying to qualify for the Olympics, so he has not qualified yet, but he did win the uh, Olympic trials. He knocked out Darmani Rock, who was the number one rated uh, super heavyweight. He, he was supposed to make it to the Olympics and possibly win gold. We know Darmani Rock has signed with Rock Nation. So, um, But Marlo Moore, the Bay Area kid, man. Prodigy of Virgil Hunter. Um, so I watched the first fight I've ever got to see him fight. I've seen one clip when he was like 16, 17 years old. It's on YouTube. He fought an old fight, and it was only like two minutes of that. So I finally got to see a clip of him, and the fight went, how long did the fight last? Two minutes, I believe. He fought a guy from Morocco. It was USA versus Morocco in the uh, World Series of Boxing, and this was actually held in Miami. And uh, Moore came out. Well, first of all, he's, he's in shape. He came out. He looked very measured and very, um, you know, like he was in control, seemed very comfortable in there. Um, the guy from Morocco, I believe his name was Buros. I forget, man, but a lot of posturing going on. Uh, Moore was looking, you know, to work his jab, just being a patient fighter and looked like it was a lot of posturing going on. Then they kind of held a little bit trying to, you know, just fill each other out. And Burros, he threw a, a lazy jab and Moore countered it with like an overhand right, knocked him down. He got up. He was kind of, you know, buzzed a little bit. The ref waved him towards him to walk towards him and then he kind of veered off to the side a little bit and the ref just waved the fight that's all i seen so I, I still didn't get to see more but from what i've seen he has a very good overhand right i know that for sure he works with virgil, with virgil hunter he's um got good sparring brian jennings uh con sheehan who was another really good amateur um so i would really like for him to win one of these qualifying events or do whatever he has to do to qualify to make the olympics i want to see uh, the super heavyweight division be represented at the Olympics by a guy from the USA. And if it's going to be a guy from the USA, it's going to be Marlo Moore. He's our only chance. He's our only hope to make the Olympics at that uh, weight class. So hopefully he gets it done. Picked up his victory in uh, his first World Series of Boxing fight. I like the World Series of Boxing. Guys get to get a lot of experience with the head gear off. Um, and you fight top-notch amateur competition in the world not just the nation or not just our country but in the world so i, I really like it um i've seen a lot of guys go through this uh alexander Usyk jr five i mean philippe herkovic they've a lot of guys have went through this so i like the world series of boxing but i really like that marlo moore picked up a victory and hopefully he can keep winning man and keep winning and uh like I said, just take care of business in these qualifying tournaments so he can qualify for the real games because I really want to see our country be represented this year, super heavyweight. And if he makes it, I'm going to be pulling for him, man. That's going to be my, that's going to be the guy I'm pulling for if he makes it. So uh, props to Marlon Moore. Hopefully he keeps winning. Just getting this out there. YTBC, I'm out.